Hello, this is Prince of Somnia, and welcome back to Let's Play Mother 3. Now, since last time, uh, I actually did a little bit of level grinding, got uh, Lucas up to level 45 there, so that he could learn PSI Shield Omega. I basically have PSI damage, so that'll really come in handy for the next upcoming boss fight, who is, spoiler alert, uh, only going to be using PSI on us, so yeah. Anyway, let's just head up this way. Reminds me of a uh, Lumine. Uh, I guess I didn't let's play that game, so never mind. We got some scampering mushrooms, but these guys uh, shouldn't be much to worry about. They're already dead. Let's move on. I also learned Life Up Gamma uh, off screen too, so that'll really come in handy. Uh, let's see if we can't lure the Titanian or one of them away. Just one. Only one. Uno! Game Uno! Dose. There we go. Took care of him. If you get into a fight with two of them, uh, Siren Beetle one of them and you should be good to go. Alright, let's move on now. Ooh, invite another new enemy here. This is the only place they can show up. The Unwelcome Gust. Very funny game. But anyway, uh, these guys... Uh, let's see... Yeah. These guys can use a multi-targeting attack that is, technically speaking, wind... or fire elemental, even though it... I think it's called the Gust Attack or something like that. I think there's just something weird about how the game's coding works, where um, most multi-targeting abilities are fire elemental, but uh, oh well. What a nice rhythm. Okay, well let's just move on. Another unwelcome gust. Let's see if I can't take one of them on, alone. Get over here. Nuts. It's a water spout ability, actually, but oh well. Okay, uh, uh nuts. There we go. Alright, and up here... Nuts. We are inventory's full. Okay, well, um, that would be a good time to start using healing items, honestly. And we get the Vigor Stick, which is a new piece of equipment for Lucas. Um, it's a massive upgrade, mostly because I haven't upgraded my equipment since getting the Friends Yo-Yo, but oh well. There was a better weapon you could have bought at Saturn Valley, but I just didn't do it, so there we go. It's a Vigor Stick, because it lets you beat things vigorously. I don't know what you were expecting, but uh, okay. And in this ch uh, chest, we get a Swallow Bandana. I'm gonna need to use a healing item from your inventory first. Um, like this beef jerky. Yeah, that'll do us good. And I guess you might as well max your own HP out. Um, and then give you the swallow bandana. Okay, now for this next boss fight, I'm actually going to equip the Rubber Cape, uh, because it's strong against Lightning on Lucas. Flame Pendants should be good for these two, and uh, Boney can just... I don't know, I don't care about him. Anyway, <laughs> anyway, uh, let's see. Oh wait, no, we're not quite done with the area, hold on. Let's wait for that until we get past the whatever enemies are around. Oh, okay, no, we were done with the area. Pay no attention to the confused man behind the screen. Anyway, yeah. Uh, let's save.
Now, if you're not level 45 and you don't have PSI uh, shield, you might want to consider equipping everyone with a Lola coat instead of uh, flame pendants because they reduce fire damage by 80%. Otherwise, uh, rubber capes, um, flame pendants, thunder pendants, either one of those are uh, really good. You want to make sure everyone's at or near max. Uh, the PP for Kumatora is not an issue here. Okay. And now we should be good to go. It's the Needle and, uh, the Barrier Trio. So we've got Barrier Man, Barrier Gal, and Barrier Dude. And Barrier Boss time! I hope you like this song, viewers, because we're gonna be hearing it a lot for the rest of the game. Alright, now these guys are actually pretty tough, so let's see here. Alright, so these guys are going to... They basically only use PSI attacks, so um, this first turn we're going to have uh, Lucas use uh, PSI Shield Omega. If you don't have Omega, use Alpha on Lucas or Kumatora and Boney. Otherwise, just go ahead and use Shield Alpha. Uh, Alright, uh, Kumatora, we're going to have her use Defense Down Alpha. Not so much because I actually care about getting their defense down, um, but because they will sometimes use defense up Omega if their defense is down, and we can take advantage of that by making them waste turns where they're not pounding us with powerful PSI. Same thought, uh, we want Duster to use the Tickle Stick in order to lower their defense the same way. And we want Boney to use the Shield Snatcher because they start off with a shield. I mean, they're the Barrier Trio, why wouldn't they? I hear that this song has like some sort of really weird beat, like it's um... Like, I, I don't remember what exactly the signature was, but it's like incredibly weird and strangely high numbered or something like that. In any case, comboing to this song is actually pretty tough. Okay, so now they're gonna strike a barrier trio pose thing, and depending on what pose they say is the uh, type of PSI they're weak to. Since Barrier Dude is the one who's calling it out, they are now weak to PK Thunder, so we're going to be using that against them. Okay, let's see. Uh, we want to have Lucas use Offense Up Omega, and we're going to have you start attacking. So we're going to use Thunder. Thunder Beta seems to be the highest level we have. Um, let's just attack. Uh, we've already lowered their defense down by one stage, so we'll just wait for them. You want to try and keep everyone's HP above 150 for this fight, because um, there's a really powerful one last attack they can do. And unlike other one last attacks, uh, you have to survive a couple of rounds afterward. So, yeah. But anyway, if you try to use any other PSI other than the one they're weak to, it does nothing. Ow. Yeah, see how much damage that did? If we didn't have the shields up, we would be in a world of hurt. Um, alright, let's go attack. Uh, Thunder Beta. Uh, everyone's HP looks like it's doing about okay, except for Bonies. So I'm gonna have him scarf down a Luxury Banana. Ah! broke their barrier pose. Okay, well when they're in a pose like this, uh, then PSI only does about half damage. Okay, so Barrier Dude is calling out the pose, so now they're back to being weak to thunder, so let's do that. Um, we're all good on HP. I can't combo to this song worth a damn, even more than uh, my other attempts at comboing. Or I could just combo right then. Okay, Thunder Beta, that's gonna hurt. Ow! Nuts. Okay. So, since Duster got hit by that, we're gonna have uh, Lucas use that. We're gonna have Kumatora continue to use Thunder Beta since it's her best DPS. And I guess we're gonna have Boney use a Yogurt on him. 
I don't trust Boney to give someone a lucky a uh, luxury banana anymore. Excellent. Okay, Barrier Gal's calling it, so now they're weak to PK Freeze. Awesome. We've got Freeze Gamma on our side, so that'll do us real nice. What are you doing? Defense up Omega. Awesome. Let's go for another tickle stick. Try to keep him down. There we go. Ow. Oh, that's not so bad. Nope, not that. Uh, just bash him. Uh, we're still good on HP. So let's attack. Although Lucas is getting a little on the light side. But I think we'll be fine. Okay. Uh, that's bad. Everyone guard. Defend. 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 When they're concentrating, that means uh, they've gotten down to zero HP and they're about to use their last attack. But again, like I said earlier, uh, it's a last attack that you actually kind of have to survive uh, over. So yeah. PK Starstorm. Holy crap! Imagine if I didn't have a shield up when that move hit. That would have killed us. Stone dead. So yeah. Um. Let's just have you two guard. The fight's basically over right now, so we don't need to worry about it. Just try to keep everyone from dying. Yeah, they're gonna concentrate again, but uh, this time we need to focus on healing. Hopefully, I'll be able to survive the next round. Okay, good. We got our life ups, so that should get us in a good place. And now they're gonna do PK Starstorm again. Oh, this is gonna suck. Uh, oh, oh, oh. Okay. Yeah. No, they uh they can't do it again. <laughs> I was just uh messing around, viewers. Yeah, they're they're pretty much done for. You don't even have to attack them at this point. They're already dead. It was spectacular. And there you go. Definitely a much easier boss fight if you have PSI Shield Omega. There we go. And we're getting some good levels off of this, too. And they died. Uh, nuts. Uh, Lucas, hurry up! Pull the needle! Pull, pull, pull the needle, Lucas! before they get a chance to set up. <sighs> of course they're not. everything. It's the uh, masked man all over again. The red carpet treatment and everything. Ow!
Well, we weren't too late, it's just we just stood there and let him take it, so, oh well. Oh, I hope our inventory isn't full. Yeah. Yeah, that was pretty disappointing. Oh, good. So we got Missy's Memento. I'm gonna put that in the storage as soon as possible. Oh, give what? A jar of yummy pickles. Okay. Oh, so we gotta talk to Mapson to figure that out. Nuts. Well, there's nothing more we can do but to head back to the beach where Ocho is waiting, so I'll just meet you guys there. Off screen. Okay, so we're back at the beach. The mushrooms are gone, by the way, so you can't eat them again. Just so you know. Okay, sure. Huh, <laughs> taxi. Not wrong. Um, how's Boney gonna fit? Oh, 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 okay. I think technically speaking, animation-wise or frame-wise or whatever, it's faster just to go into the ocean and let yourself drown, but... Whatever, we'll do it this way. Oh, looks like they're, uh, I didn't even know they could talk. Oh, we're back, but the music sounds a little different. What's going on? It's all sad now. And you're really sunburned. I wonder what happened. Oh, those two that used to be here are gone, and so is the snack cart. Oh, everyone's leaving to go to uh, New Pork City. If you remember that guy at the uh, factory way back and earlier in the chapter, we're talking was talking about that. couldn't tell by my uh, little bit of quietness, I love the music at this point in the game. It's so tragic because after everything that's gone on in Tasmili and everything that's changed, now they're just... everything's gone. Everyone's left. Except for a few people here and there, they're all going to the big city. Oh, I guess these people are still around, but, uh, oh well. I'm gonna go rest up, and, uh, yeah, Mapsin marked our map for us, the Tasmili map that we got way earlier in the game. That's where we're headed off to, and we'll go to see Ionia in the next episode of Let's Play Mother 3. See you guys then.